Why does it look like Ethan and Eila are about to drop the firest track of 2016 right now? It's because it's our new album called Ethan and Eila, a little hip, a little hip hop. Pound it. Eila, your hat is so straight. You're the whitest person alive. Can you put a little tilt on it, please? No, tilt, straight is the new tilt. Straight will never be the new tilt. It's the new gangster. <laughs> if anything, the new tilt is a popped, is popped no, in the front. Pop is so like white people trash. White people trash? How can you say that to your sweet loving husband? Straight, yes, husband, by the way. Straight is so badass. What are you talking about? I feel pretty hip, pretty dope, pretty hip hop. <laughs> Welcome back to another episode of Ethan and Ela. We're finally back from Las Vegas. Um, we haven't taken off this outfit since we our, haven't changed. We haven't changed. I mean, you guys thought you guys probably thought it was just the outfit for that one video, but when we said 2016 summer look, we meant it. Yeah. So you can expect us to be wearing this outfit in every video, H3, Ethan, and Neela, everywhere, guys. This is not a joke. This is not a joke. You guys thought we were kidding? Please support us at thegap.com forward slash h 3 h 3 new summer look 2016 spelled with letters, not numbers. Thank you so much. There's been a lot of comments being left. A lot of people talking shit. All kinds of shit. People talk so much shit. Well, it's time to address it, okay? So we've found our favorite comments and we are gonna t address them now. Ela, let's get this shit rolling. This fucking Jew with his clickbait titles and fuck Reddit. Remember when you made fun of Leafy for having clickbait titles like this? Or This was fucking clickbait. I am not happy. Incredibly disappointed. Uh, which video was that from, those comments? So a lot of it was from the, we finally kiss. Wow, okay. 18 plus only. So they're, these guys were disappointed because they came expecting to be able to fucking put their dick in their hand and jerked off to some incest porn, weird and gross. Also, I mean, is it not obvious that it's like a joke? Oh yeah, here? and by the way, it's a fucking joke. Like, wow, 18 plus only, must watch till the end, share with five people on <laughs> Facebook. Must share to lift the curse of the not kiss. It's like, people have gotten so crazy about clickbait, which I guess is a reaction to like Leafy and all these other commentary channels that have titles like, the cringiest kid in the whole universe exists ever. Click now or you'll fucking, your grandma will take a tumble. You know what I mean? It's like, yeah, there's that level of clickbait where you can literally not tell one video from the other. Yeah, but this like, video. There's a difference if you do it on every video. Every video. I mean, what, can we not make fun of clickbait now? Is it all can wrong? I, hey, by the way, can I not put a catchy title? People want this to be like, we read, we read com your comments. Part two out of 17. Yeah, we read your comments part two out of 17. This video is, is mediocre. You don't have to watch. We don't recommend you. We have other videos. Don't watch this video. We'll put that in the whole title next time. Since when did good, catchy titles become bad? Clickbait is meant to make you click. If it describes what happens in the video in a way that makes you want to click the video, then it's a fucking successful title. Okay? Can you fucking distinguish between clickbait that doesn't tell you what's in the video and a good title, guys? Think a little bit. Don't just fucking cry clickbait because I'm about to fucking have an aneurysm. Okay, I will die if I see another clickbait complain. Ethan, all I gotta tell you is that I'm unsubbing right now. Dude, you just clickbaited me in that comment <laughs> because you can't unsub me. This is real life. You completely misled I'm unsubbing. me. unsubbing. You just fucking clickbaited my ass, I'm Ela. removing you from my sub box, by the way. <laughs> oh, wow, <laughs> and dude. And I'm unsubbing. <laughs> <laughs> So, okay, you know what, clickbait whiners, and a special, special in memorial for, can you open that one comment? The last one, this one I think. This was fucking clickbait! I am not happy, incredibly disappointed! Like, the video was fun, he enjoyed it, he had that like half second of reading the title that just made him so angry, dude. But the, t the video was great. He had a lot of fun watching it. And thanks for your comment, yeah. too, by the way. Wow. Oh, my God. Copy off of Good Mythical Morning. More fag. Your hat looks like my sack. 
Oh my god, this one is a rant. <laughs> Which video is this from? This is from one of the new ones. I think the jet ski maybe. Mm. All right, are you guys ready? Brace yourself for a novel. This guy took some time out of his day here. Damn, Ethan, for once in your life, shave, get a haircut, and dress nice all at once, for fuck's sake! I love you both, but I'm so fucking tired of seeing you two steps away from looking like a bum. Fuck, 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 shit! I got problems, okay? This bothers me way too much. <laughs> Frankly, you didn't even have to mention that, but I appreciate you acknowledging that. Pip yourself out, man. Go to a barbershop run by Puerto Ricans and say you want the Asiki yellow. Okay. Very specific advice. <laughs> Look, fucking bill me, dude. I'll pay. Just fucking try. For Ela's sake, you have the potential to be an eight. Wow. That guy believes in me. But you walk around like a three and a half. More effort, Ethan. That's all I'm saying. No homo. Clearly no homo. You didn't need to add that. <laughs> I guess maybe even saying that I had the potential to be eight w was a threat to his masculinity. Okay, dude. You know what? This this comment is hit me deep. Because I feel like I he says I had the potential to be eight and no one has ever had that much faith in me before. And I really want to... I want to break out my inner beauty for Jade Lura Ducaco. Today, for you, Jade, I'm putting my hat backwards. Oh, shit. I'm going to go find out the slickest Puerto Rican barber for an Ask Leo. <laughs> Today, everything changes, and I'm not kidding. Watch, because up next, our next video... Must watch till the end. Much watch this video to the end. I'm going to tell you what our next video is, but let me <laughs> tell you, you are not going to believe it. Can I clickbait in a video? Yeah, don't forget to share, comment, and Guys, subscribe. Guys, please watch to the end of this video. We have a huge surprise for you. Must watch to the end. Cannot skip because there's surprises throughout the whole video. There's like 10 <laughs> surprises the whole way. Must not skip. <laughs> that should be a new one. <laughs> Must not skip. So, Jade, I appreciate the concern for you. Clearly, you do have a problem. I think you need to relax. But at the same time, you put me down a road of self-discovery. I want to fulfill my destiny to become an eight. Do you think I could be an eight? I'm the one who married you. You saw the eight in me the I, whole time. I always do. <laughs> That's so special. <laughs> I appreciate that so much that you saw the eight in me, even though I was walking around like a 3.5. <laughs> that honestly means a lot to me. Thank you. Dude. <laughs> wow. Okay. Let's be, let's go. The road to becoming an eight, guys. Let's do it. The most disgusting thing about this video is Ethan's shirt. <laughs> Are you fucking serious, dude? Do you know how hard we worked on this outfit? Walmart, Banana Republic Hot Topic, okay, just approached us about putting our gear in their store. I mean, I can't win with these people, dude. They're so rude, they're so judgmental. What do you think about my shirt? I like it. Is this an eight or a 3.5? It's an eight and a half. You fucking heard it here, dude. This is an 8.5. Hold the fuck up. We're just gonna let it slide that Ela doesn't like bacon? Okay, I quit. I hate bacon. That's all I gotta say. I have to agree with him, honestly. <laughs> this is a huge hurdle in our relationship. <laughs> like, I know we're supposed to make fun of the commenters and support it. each other, but the fact that you don't like bacon is, is a problem for our, not just our relationship, but our channel. I don't get it. I don't like the flavor. I don't like the texture. It stinks. You just went from an eight to a 3.5. I'm unsubbing you. <laughs> Dude, you must watch my rant till the end, though. Because there are surprises throughout the whole thing, and you cannot skip. But seriously, we need to do a Ela Eats Bacon 30 minutes of yeah. Ela eating bacon. I really don't get the bacon thing. I fucking love bacon. I don't know what it is. I mean, I, I am from Israel, and it's not a thing there, so I didn't grow up eating it. So yeah, I it's suspect. It's just like a weird thing to me. I suspect that's what it is. I think all of us Americans and Europeans grew up eating bacon, so we have this just absolute love. It's fun. We just love it. And but I you mean, love it like too much. No, I know. It's sick, but I do. I love it. I can't not love it. It's just great. It's not. It is. <laughs> You can't argue this point with me, Ela. You want to drop down to a 2.3? Because I'll drop your ass down, and you must watch till the end. There are surprises throughout this rant. Next. Again. And let's not forget the again. Dude. Again. Ela is so bitchy <laughs> about everything. 
She hates everything. That's why she's anorexic. <laughs> Damn, that is so savage. And 26 <laughs> thumbs ups, too. People were like, Yeah. That is why. That's why she's anorexic. Also, that's why she's bitchy again, because she's always bitchy. Okay. And that's why she hates everything. I feel like people, I think this is not just your problem, but with shy girls in general, people mistake their shyness for bitchiness. Maybe. But also, on the other like, hand, you're playing a character. Yeah, sometimes we're just joking. We we battle. Ela's the straight one, and I'm the crazy one. And sometimes I go a little too crazy, and I get all fucking enthusiastic about bacon and shit, and Ela says, chill out, Ethan. Bacon's not that dope. Which but is then, a reasonable thing to say. I'm anorexic because I don't like bacon. Yeah, that makes sense. Well, it makes sense. It's shit. It's fatty. You are such a bitch. <laughs> you are so bitchy again. That felt bad to say. I would never call Eel a bitch. Thank and I did you. it only in the context of this conversation. And it felt really bad. I'm sorry I called you that. But it was it was for this bit. I think you're lovely. I love you. I think you're great. And you're not a bitch. You are a caring, sweethearted, warm person. And that's why I married you. Even though I find you to be a 3.5 inside. <laughs> in, on, on the outside, you're a 3.5. But on the inside, you're a solid 8.5. Not wow. bitchy. No disrespect, because I love Ela, but can someone tell me, does she have some kind of condition or something? Because her eyes look really bruised and tired. Does it look like I have a condition? Now it does. <laughs> now it definitely does. Am I concealing my bags? Ah, you, I can't you, you just want to poke me in the eye. You're turning around. Oh my God, dude! <laughs> dude, we're gonna get so many subscribers tonight. Oh, <laughs> we're looking so good right now. <laughs> this eye is good. It looks like I'm crying. It looks sick. We look sick. Yeah. We look more sick than we ever did without it. Now we have a condition. <laughs> now, yeah, exactly. <laughs> I just want to say as nice as possible, I fucking hate you! I use your videos when I need to throw up. Whatever channels you do watch, I'm sure are very proud and happy to have you in their audience. <laughs> Sure, you make a terrific, terrific contribution to their community. Ethan and Ela aren't that bad for being fucking Jews. Huge compliment. Found it. Huge fucking compliments <laughs> coming from this guy. Thank you so much, dude. Appreciate that. I feel like Ethan is just using this video as an elaborate scheme, so none of us will say anything about him dyeing his hair. That was from the Black Challenge. Three thousand upvotes brock <laughs> jensen you think you're fucking slick dude you think that i'm insecure about my gray hair <laughs> nah dude not at all dog <laughs> You see, you guys were all talking shit, talking about how I dyed my hair. I did the whole video just to make my hair black. Well, I just cut it off and proved all you haters wrong. Except that it still looks black. It's still black and it actually looks significantly worse now because it's like really weird fade into gray. Did I prove the haters wrong, Eula? Yeah. Thanks for watching. Wow, Ethan, great move. Keep it up.